These are the weirdest traps ever. Just don't even get how they work. Does anybody know how this trap works? Like, so what? He comes in to get the rabbit? Presumably it knocks that stick, maybe? And then what? How does it... How does the trap actually... I don't get it. How does it work? This is a construction hideout or something. I'm gonna walk. Uh, if you like a game that you can play at your own pace, this is the ideal. Yeah. You couldn't get that trap, your best guess is the top log falls and traps the links. I, I just don't get it. I don't get how it works at all. It, like, in the picture, it shows the same thing. So it must be a legitimate thing. Spike, have a good one. Just noticed on his left hand where he's holding the binoculars, the bristles on his thumb on the fur are actually moving. <laughs> details. What's a trap called, Bringle? I don't know. Something just bolted. You can get this game on Steam. You can also get it on the PlayStation, I think. I had something run away. Over here somewhere. I'm not bad, Garden Data. How are you doing? Yeah, it did sound like a bear, actually. I reckon it went in that direction. We'll go this way. What was that trap made to catch? Uh, what was it under? Yeah, it was one of these, wasn't it? Rabbit. Fresh rabbit yielding better than before, good for trapping. I don't know. I don't know what it's designed to trap. A few bites, no triggers, no bites, no bites. I, I, I can't explain. It's also an Xbox. Let's investigate that. It's a lynx trap. So there you go. So how does the okay, lynx... Okay, so with the daily challenge, it seems as though you basically keep getting a credit score increase if you 
um, down it within 30 meters. So I just the first one was like 100. I just got 200, and the next one is like 1350. I'm not sure what you mean. So you know on the daily ch challenges page, not the not the community one, but the the actual daily one. Yeah. It's got the first step says so it's basically split up into thirds so the first kill you get tier one you have to do two kills to get to tier two which is that second dot tier three is the final dot and you have to get two kills to do that so you have to basically get six kills within 30 meters with a rifle to get the tier three daily score which is 1350 credits by the looks of this weird the most dangerous animal of all human really so if i put you in a pit with a bar would you still call yourself the most dangerous animal right let's have a look trophy rating 20 oh, look at that shot the spine and the right lung ouch 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 GG, nice shot. Yeah, it stood up, so I took advantage of that. Yeah, but Owen, how does that trap work? That's what I want to know. So when the lynx or whatever comes along and grabs the rabbit, um, I've what happens? Down to that first question mark, it is just a, a blind, but you might as well unlock it. Okay. So if I go to my Hunter Club daily thing, up close with a rifle, harvest wildlife down with a rifle within 30 meters, um, it's not moved in any way. So it, it, mine's mine's now at the middle dot, so the second dot along. Mine's not. But have you shot anything within 30 meters? Okay, I'm going to specifically find something to kill within 30 meters now. Because I do not know. Basically, if it's close, I know you want to use your bow and level that up, but in order for the daily challenges, I think you need to use your rifle. Yep, totally. Uh, the top log falls down on the front paws of the lynx and keeps it from moving. Really? It's like that simple. Blimey. Surely when the log falls down, the, there's a very good chance that it won't trap it. Like, how much luck is there in a log falling down and trapping its legs? Is it a guaranteed trap every time? You know, like, say, like a mouse trap. I can see how a mouse trap works. You know, the mouse comes in, gets the cheese... Releases the catch, spring comes over, boom, game over. I get that. It's not guaranteed, but it has a very high success rate. This falling log thing, there's it, nothing to power it, so... If the lynx is quick enough, it'll just defeat gravity, won't it? It'll just be like, boom, I'm gone before the log even falls. That's the bit I'm not getting. Eating. This is where the links hang out. I guess how it works is that the uh, 
that wrong animal grabs that hanging animal and pulls down something. Uh, sorry, yeah, John Fly, it has arrived intact. I was going to message you. Thank you very much, sir. I've not opened it to see if it's okay, but the box looks fine, so... I shall, uh, I shall open it up and check it. Yeah, if the animal pulls it down, then that could initiate something. I just want to know how it works. I want, I want to see like a, like a diagram that goes, this happens, this happens, this happens. Hey, Book Entertainment, how you doing? What's odd about the physics is no such thing as a vacuum and gravity pushes us to the pole. Jeez, that was close. get eyes on this it'll be a 30 meter kill no problem I need to swing right because I want to keep the scent going that way it's really close I just heard it. It must have detected me. I heard it over there run away, but I didn't see it. Your wife turned into the stream the other day. Within a minute, you had a kill, she thinks. He's sister. And bro could really get into this game. Go find out if that landed. I think so, John. Uh, I really do. And you can multiplayer it as well, up to eight people. So they can either hunt together and you know, like learn together, spot for each other, or see who can get the most kills, etc. I've not seen the latest Star Wars film, no. I'll watch it over Christmas. Massive overkill. Flesh, pelvis, and intestines. That's not bad. Oh, 109 meters. I thought it was closer than that, Sammy. No. They, they have to be basically sitting next to you. And you yeah. just have to go ping. That was more of an opportunity kill, that one. Yeah, well, you have those, don't you? It's all part of the rough with the smooth, isn't it? Right, so... The tent that I've put down next to the question mark is um, just a blind, which is useless. The next one up is um, a point of interest, and then where I am now is another point of interest. But because I haven't brought my tent with me, I can't get you up here quickly. All right. Well, I'll just port in, then, and then uh, you can remove... Speedy driver, I am back, so I have missed anything good. Kill a reindeer while I was away, lol. Uh, I've killed a few things. We've also switched map, I think, since you was here. Yeah, you should totally have a go of it, John. Like, if you like hunting, you'll love this. Totally. 
Uh, digi docks, no, you can only if you've got the ATV that you have anything to drive. Musketeer. What was that one on the coast? You say? Yeah, the the coast one is a is a point of interest. Uh, what is your take on the yeah. Africa map? Best game in the world, but is PC. Oh, do you mean for this game? Are they going to do an African map? Is is that in any way confirmed? Wildlands playing GTA. Well, I've seen a few other um, moderator type people fire up GTA, so I wonder what they could possibly be playing. Heist, maybe? Maybe. I see them. See, you think the mods see everything. Paul sees everything. <laughs> Once by a feature, did not know about this. I like the deeds on the ground and messing around with P3D, but don't tell anyone. Whoa. It's a beautiful game, John. Beautiful game. Because you're like me, you like sunsets and scenery and stuff, and it is just... It's just magnificent. Look at it. And it gets better than that. <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> and yeah, up to eight people, John. <clears throat> John Fly, you're an X-Plane man. If you start messing about with P3D, X-Plane's going to uninstall itself. Austin Myers going to come round your house. GTA? You've been on Steam for years? You are cheating. You've been unfaithful. If we can grab his track and see what direction he's heading. It's not the best place to hunt. Where are you? A shot to nothing. See if we can get a bleed out of him. Chewy inspired me. Streamed on X plane was phenomenal. You stream on X on XP. On X plane. Do you mean X plane or XP? What do you mean, John? Apparently I didn't land that. You bit the bullet. Oh, right, okay. Finally. Finally decided to try explain. I think I saw Matt streaming the other day and he was in P3D. P3D. I think he was coming into like JFK. And he must have had like 12 FPS or something. I was thinking, just no way. Do 
you think this game would be good without others playing? You can play it on your own. If you play it on your own, you get like missions and stuff, particularly on this um, DLC. It's like structured, gives you a lot of history in the area and stuff. It's quite good, quite interesting. You got a Lynx? I got a Lynx. Um, have you been up to that um, point of interest yet? Or? No, a bear distracted me. Uh, okay. I got one of them. Didn't get the one on the coast yet. Point you got at him, and then the game on glitches. I heard him. I hit him that time, though. I heard him. That like a vital shot. That's quite a big, quite a big blob of blood. That is medium. Yeah, he died pretty quick. Oh, this is the annoying thing about the game, though, is this. It's not been able to get up the simplest of slopes. Flesh, right lung. Not bad. We got him. 500 meters, but we got him. Stream the Harrier. Yeah, I'm... I'm going to sort my DCS to 2.5, try out the Harrier at some point. Oh, reindeer, why you distract me? back on track now or why well I was just going to put a tent down for you to get this question mark because it's nothing major but I'll just give you that as a discovery then okay I'll go and get this it's just a blind so it's nothing spectacular but I'll just keep your map sort of tidy try out the Harrier give it a brief kill with the VR no thanks While it's Christmas, we'll leave the reindeer alone, okay. Pretty certain Santa's got his own, but whatever. He might need some replacement parts. Then. So, I've already killed a reindeer. Oh, naughty Sommy. Right. Tell me this game is not beautiful, look at that. Well, I didn't know we had a, a, a no reindeer policy. Look, you can create your own wallpapers. Create your own desktop wallpapers. You don't need to paint it. You don't need to be Bob Ross. You just play the game. DCS multiplayer. Possibly sniffer. The, the problem is with DCS multiplayer is it needs organization. Um, you need somebody to construct the mission. You know, actually physically create the mission. You need somebody to host it. And that will reveal that person's IP, so that's not going to be me. You need 
people who can actually fly because it's not an easy game it's quite a complex game as you know it's a simulation so it's doable but it's not uh without its problems right i'm now at this trapper point okay Welcome to blah 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 blah, Wild Coast Paradise. Only this is no paradise at all, Russian irony, my friend, buckle up. Let's have a cheeky look on there, let's see if we can see anything. You never know. Okay, that's a bit of a drop. So you've got a tent down. Yeah. No, you can't swim. If you approach water, it'll let, let it go to about waist height and then it'll stop. What? It's just a ladder? Yeah, it's just a blind, but what I've found is that if you discover all the question marks on the map when you're at the higher level, it'll take all the green dots off rather than leave the ones that you haven't discovered. Okay. Captain Teleport. I would love a survival side of this as well. Young Gun, instead of it just being a hunting game, hunt a survival game with crafting. Um, and then add another factor. I don't know what. Uh, it's called Martin Deadfall Battle. What is crafting in zombies? I don't think we need another zombie game. I think the zombie games have, have uh, gone away for a while. I saw, I think it was yet last night, I was browsing Twitch game list. And DayZ, I think, had about 100 players in total. It's just nuts. Um, I found a double question mark at my location that was not indicated on the map. Okay. One's an information point, the other's a tower. Wow, okay. But it, it wasn't listed with the observation tower. I'm calling hacks. Yeah, I'll put my tent down if you want it. Tractor Lynx here last night, I think I scared him off. It's trapper number three. Trapper oh. number three. So that's all five then, right? Possibly. But yeah, this wasn't listed at all. Wow. Good night, Eagle Fist. That's quite a big. There's on this map. There's quite a few big chunks of just black. That makes you wonder, now, doesn't it? Ooh, and it makes you wonder. <laughs> well, yeah, it does make you wonder if there's more like that, which is bound to be really. The red well, one. If you go to Zeno, um, Zenova La Hale, where we started, there's like the whole west hand side of that is just black. Uh, what, the actual hill? West of that is just yeah, water so and stuff. You, but if you go to the outpost, 
then you've got the blind, but then between the the landmark and the blind and then the other blind, that's all just black terrain that hasn't been discovered. Because it's like just what you've walked into now. Yeah. So is it sort of a case of you need to explore every inch of this map? <laughs> yeah, well, there's bonus stuff if you do, put it that way. Wow. Uh, the red one, getting those Christmas emotes, carry on. Followed by sharing some Christmas emotes, whoever gets them, enjoy. <laughs> Thank you, red one. track this way and see what happens. I've teleported down the map to see what's down here. Okay. Isn't, I don't really have much left up there, I don't think. I don't know how much of this bit you've discovered where I am. I've got question marks now. Looks pretty hilly. Scratch that, looks very hilly. No. Nothing that wrong fits. with sprouts. Um, I've got a couple of question marks to get, but nothing in the in that sort of zone that hasn't been discovered. I've got a couple of question marks now. Well, the terrain's pretty awful. Sprouts are just the devil's vegetable. Welcome back, Andy Drew. Ouch. Hmm. I don't know what that is. Speedy. The new game tomorrow is another sim. Uh, kind of, yes, maybe, ish. Hmm. How old was this trot, I wonder? Oh, I like olives, Leanna. I used to dislike olives a lot when I was younger. And then I rediscovered them again. And now I love olives. Olives, feta cheese cubes, sun-dried tomatoes. All that stuff. Come on, Burr, I need to get an age indication here. It's gone the right way, I just don't know how old these tracks are.
Your seven-year-old loves olives. He used to hate them. I think it's a different ones taste different as well. I like them when they've been deseeded, though. It's not fun when you think an olive's been deseeded and you go to bite it and find out it's not. It's just not fun at all. Trade all your sprouts for all your sprout lovers, your olives. Oh, yeah. One sprout, two olives. Let's do it. Have you found anything yet? I'm on my way to a question mark at the moment. I'm 500 meters away. Favorite cheese? I don't really have a favorite cheese. I like a lot of cheeses. Not many I don't like, really. I hear a bear running on the spot. Think he got free. I can hear it, I just can't see it. This is the weirdest thing. Like it was here just now and I could hear it. It got stuck and then started running. Multiplayer games, thank you for the uh, 250 bits. Thanks for the fun today. Paul, I really get to see you live. I'm out for the day. Merry Christmas, everyone. Have a good one. Glad you got to catch me live. I've not tried out the uh, shotty yet, no. Still getting the rifles sorted out and the bow on the side. deer on the way. Maybe we can get one or both of them. <laughs> that hurt him a lot. Hmm? What? Right, I literally just caught the game hacking. Yeah? Yep, I just caught it being absolute hacky hack. Like, I <laughs> shot a bear, blood spewed out, it stepped forward about 10 feet, and then it teleported forward and just vanished, like it went into space. You know the Star yeah, Trek, it when it when it goes into warp speed? It literally did that. Yeah, I just about saw the clip of... I looked over at the stream as you'd shot, and I was yep. like... Zoo. 
I have proof that the game actually cheats. <laughs> Rocket bar. I mean, I know bears have adrenaline and stuff when you're shooting, but that's ridiculous. That, that was a bit OP, yeah. So are you still chasing it? or? I'm tracking it. It, it teleported about a kilometre in the space of a couple of seconds, I think. It has a bleed rate of medium, but it's still managing to run absolutely fine. I just caught the game with its pants down. We know it cheats now. Proof. Considering it's, it's a medium bleed rate, it's taken a long time to bleed. You think it's a synchronization issue? There's only me and Sommy on the server, though. It's a bit weird. Man, this thing won't die. Desync bar. Not to twenty-five. Look at the um, look at my eye squirrel. Look at the state of that track. How nuts that is. Not to twenty-five percent. There it is. Found it. Good. So at least it didn't despawn it, right? Correct. Left scapula and left lung, and it ran for a long, long time. Oh, 35 meter kill, are you kidding me? <laughs> Not quite close enough. Let's put, it ran over three to 400 meters or in uh, in the space of two seconds. That was interesting. Can you hunt your friends? No. That would be silly. Let's go and find out what this is. It was decent, though. Definitely was decent, though. Going dark. That's what I've got on Chippy. I got my character with a big fur coat on. Snipes, 14 months. Good day to you from Texas, sir. Hope all is well. 14 months well on the way. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much, Crawley. And holes in shoes. Thanks for the resume, sir. Whenever I read your name, holes in shoes, it always reminds me of that song. Um, remember the young ones? And the young ones, that guy, uh, is it Nigel? What's his name? Neil, Nigel? 
He has a song about a hole in his shoe. And it always reminds me of that. Right, the question mark is, drum roll plus, a Blind. tower. Do you want to swap? If you can just put a tent down. Tent is down. My tent is down. Nanette. Go in. Oh, God. Press the map key. End up on the desktop. I did not mean to do that. I I'll went to click the map key and accidentally hip shot it, and it was like, boom, and it made me jump. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, can you remember when I did that last time? It was, you know, you alt tab in and you click the mouse to get the focus back on that screen <laughs> and it fires a shot. It's like. And when you're oh, not expecting dude. it, it's properly scary. Yeah. So I think this game is worth buying because I'm used to playing Simulator on PS4 Pro, so the FS17 and other. I'm not sure about the last bit, Connor, but uh, yes, I, I believe this game is well worth the money. Huge amounts of playability here for the money. Yeah, it's kind of going dark, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Why would you like me to um, fire up the time machine? Yeah. Okay, I've just got a, a waypoint that I'm going to. It's 550 metres. I'll get that and then let you know. Yeah, if you could just move the sun around a bit so it com comes back up, that'd be nice. Okay. I'll just get to the waypoint, yeah? It's better on PC. Most games are. <laughs> oh, hello. Okay, we are not upwind. Let's see if we can spot this. Old terrain, please. I'm just thinking, when he fast forwards time, Welcome back. I bet this thing's going to disappear. Welcome. Chucks, thank you for the resume, Chucks. And Lurch with the resume. Heard something to my left, but I don't see any tracks. There we go. That was it. Pringles, why did God make only one Yogi Bar? Because when he tried to make a second one, he made a boo boo. Oh, my God, Pringle. Thank you, Pringle. Hmm. Pringle, the man with the gags. Well, now we know which way that went. This is not ideal terrain. Oh, oh, oh. 
Uh, Mr. Case, here is for the best community, 1,000 bits. Mr. Case, thank you very, very much. Thank you for that. I wonder if... You just saw three days. Are you serious? What, over here? Well, I didn't see him, Bigfooty. Are you serious? Mad Bells, thank you for the resume. Hmm. Doesn't make any sense because the tracks are not here anymore. Push on, see what we find. Interesting that the tracks back there are now here as well. Uh, you just saw this, it doesn't help me too much. I know what it's going to be. It's going to be the fact that uh, Crytek is suing. We talked about it the other day. A mating call in the middle of the night. Unbelievable. Flowing trails are tracks. That's how you hunt. You, you track things down. When the animals move around, they leave footprints and things like that. Droppings. It's one of the ways you can track them. But you also find, like, where they've rested. You know, you can detect that as a hunter. this was it probably spotting it in this these conditions though Uh, 
Right, okay. So, you need to travel to my tent. What, in order to speed up time? No, not to do... I can do time now, actually, that's the point. One sec, one sec, one sec. Just let me see if I can spot this guy, because if you move time, I'm guessing he'll disappear. Right, okay. I will, that's fine, then. I've got a tent down, so I'm just going to go off and get, get retrieve an animal that I shot from up afar. Okay. How many hours? Uh, 45. Played the original as well, but not as much as this. Mostly because the game was pay to play. Rest zone. I'm thinking snow at night is not easy. gone. I think he must be moving at the same rate as me. So I'm not actually catching up. Oh, maybe I'm on top of it. Because it turned and then became downwind. Spot it, you stupid game. I literally spammed the E key and it wouldn't spot it. 